What's up, guys? Welcome to UMBX. That's Justin. And this is Matt. And today, we're actually going to take you guys Black Friday shopping. Yeah, it's a little bit of a different one. We're going shopping. Basically, the idea of this one is we're going to do a little bit of a vlog style. Yeah, a little we're different. Gonna, we're going to go out to these stores. And we're just going to kind of have a little fun with it and tell you guys what we think are the best buys for this coming Black Friday. Because it's not actually Black Friday. Like, I don't know if you're watching this on Black Friday. Well, well, you shouldn't be. You should have already planned. You should have already pre-planned. You should have pre. You this is a yeah. pre. This is a pre-shop watch. Yeah, don't don't watch. I'm, I view. Thanks for the view. If you are, but like. <laughs> but shut it off. But hopefully, we can help <laughs> you guys decide whether or not these are good deals. So disclaimer: We're gonna be trying to find the best budget deals, yeah. best deals in general. So if you're looking for higher end things, yeah, this isn't gonna be quite the video for you. It's gonna be people who are looking for really good. Um, Quality at a really cheap price. So for TVs and laptops, we're keeping under a thousand dollars. For just about everything else, we're trying to stick right around the hundred dollar mark. Yes, that's exactly where we're right around a hundred or below. As far as stores, we're gonna hit the big three. We're gonna hit Walmart, Target, and Best Buy. Hopefully, this will help you guys. Uh, we're gonna be right back, and we'll see you in the store. We're going to the store. Oh shit! <laughs> well, boys, we hit the jackpot this time. All right, so we just got done looking at TVs. We got it narrowed down to three price points. So this is the or at around a thousand option. Yeah. So you're at eleven ninety nine. So it's twelve hundred bucks. Yes. It's a Sony. This is the X nine hundred F. Yes. Uh, full array, four K, local dimming, excellent picture quality. It's got a high end processor, so you're gonna get a lot of smooth motion off of it. Yep. Um, this is my pick. The Sony X nine hundred F. Eleven ninety nine, three hundred dollars off. You can get it right now. You don't gotta wait in line. Vanilla. It's on sale right now. Vanilla, that's, Vanilla. that's the one. There it is. <laughs> we are now at the best TV for at or around 500 bucks, 599. This is the Samsung LED 7 series. This is a 4K. Um, pretty awesome picture with HDR for that price. Um, this is going to be our pick for the $500 or less. This is my budget TV pick. Uh, the TCL. Uh, this is the 5 series. This is the 55 inch. $399.99. This also has built-in Roku, uh, which is awesome. So you get a smart TV that works really well, a really solid picture, and a really great price point. We were going to look at the UE 2LE that's on sale for Black Friday. Um, unfortunately, they don't have it up here, so we can't listen to it. Um, but it's right down here. The Boom 2LE Limited Edition. Um, the reviews online say they sound pretty good. Yeah. $69.99. But unfortunately, so. we can't hear it for you guys right here right now so, so can't we can't tell you about it say your no, your name yeah do at your own risk we have the sony xb41 right here um it looks really really nice uh has nice rgb nice drivers it has really really good sound um it's only 125 dollars it doesn't get as loud as if we would like it to but i mean it's 125 dollars off so we like it it's a pretty good deal checking out the charge 4 here which is probably going to be my pick out of the the ue boom the 2le and the uh, sony this one's gonna be louder i think the sony sounds a little better but for the quality you're getting on this it still sounds fantastic and it is louder totally waterproof it floats, floats. Um, it's got an amazing battery life it sounds great so this is gonna be my pick yeah only a hundred dollars you can't go wrong the other one has rgbs kind of looks cooler but this one's louder. Also, these Bluetooth speakers that we looked at, um, they are going to be on sale at Target as well, the JBL Charge 4 and the uh, Sony XB41. So, wherever the line's shorter, you know, you can go there, or if you like Target better, you know, red versus blue, who knows? We got tons of deals on smart devices. The Echo Dots are going to be on sale for $22. The Echo Show is going to be on sale for $49. So, that's $30 off the $79.99 price tag the fire sticks those are also going to be on sale we got the uh the regular fire stick is going to be 19 dollars on black friday the 4k ones those ones are going to be 24 dollars. so five dollars more gets to that uh better quality we we'll definitely say go for that none of these are on sale right now though so if you want those you're gonna have to wait in line unfortunately but you might be able to get out on amazon and if you are partial to roku uh using their streaming services this one is going to be on sale for $29. That is the 4K version. If you like Roku, $20 off. 
So it goes from $49.99, so you focus to $20. $9.99. Now we're taking a look at some earbuds, um, wireless, completely wireless earbuds. Um, the J Buds Air Trues. These are $49.99 right now, but on Black Friday they are going to be $30. Just $30. We do have some experience with the Air Executives. Um, really good review on that. But if you're looking, I think these are going to be really comparable and for $30. It's a good price for some wireless earbuds. The Air Executives, they're $69.99, but at Walmart, they are going to be $35. Hey guys, so we came to Target to try to show you some of the deals that they have. Um, unfortunately, they don't have any of them. They don't have any of the TVs on the shelves. Uh, they don't have any on the wall. They don't even have any for us to look at uh, in the boxes. So we don't know which ones are which. Yes. Um, they don't have the tablet, the Samsung 10.1 inch tablet that was on sale. Um, it's literally missing. Let's go back to it. <laughs> Here. There's a Samsung 10.1 inch. Here it inch. is, the 10.1 inch. <laughs> so, kind of let down, but um, they do have some good deals here that I'm sure will be out here Black Friday if you want to check it out. Um, we're a little disappointed we didn't get to check them out for you today though. So we got the Skull Candy uh, Indies in black, usually 85 bucks. They're gonna be $50. $50? Which is actually a really good deal for me. Those yes. are really solid earbuds. So there's a lot of stuff on sale that we can't really recommend or not recommend. Um, the Amazon tablets are really comparable in price. All the all the smart devices, the Fire TV sticks, Roku TV sticks, those things are all the same price here as they are Best Buy. So, and Bluetooth speakers. So, if you prefer Target instead of Best Buy, or maybe the line shorter, then you can head over here and get those same deals. But otherwise, they got it at Best Buy too. So this isn't Black Friday shopping. We're just hungry, starving. We're just gonna get some food. Right, we're at Walmart now. See what they got. All right, so we're at Walmart now. Um, mostly everything like we already covered, like speakers and all that stuff. So it's mostly like TVs, yeah, like the real Walmart, like the real like budget cheap cheap ones. Yeah, yeah. The cool thing about Walmart is you don't have to wait outside. True. Because they're open 24 hours, you can't buy the stuff until the designated times. But like you can wait inside. And you remember to get these deals. You have to show up. Early. Yeah, you're gonna show up early, get in line. Usually they have the stuff on a pallet, and then they have someone like cut the plastic, and then you gotta get in there and grab it. That's when you see people jumping Don't on top be of stuff. To elbow some people. <laughs> you know, throw some bows. Especially old ladies and kids. Black Friday, everything at stake here. <laughs> We're looking at one of the doorbuster deals, the Phillips 65 inch. This actually isn't the exact model number, but sometimes they make specific model numbers for these. Now the color on this seems to be inverted or messed up somehow i'm not really sure and it seems blurry so i don't have a lot of faith in that of yeah. course um but that doesn't necessarily mean it's going to be bad if you're looking for just a super cheap big tv can't really go wrong can't really go wrong like 278 dollars yeah 65 inch i think that's got some really nice smart features they yeah, have a couple it, it is a built-in android tv so here. you're gonna have like a netflix and uh, you won't have Amazon uh, Prime, but you'll have other stuff on there. So, really cheap 65 inch picture quality looks pretty bad, but if you're not <laughs> yeah. worried about that, boom, cheap big TV under $300. Boom. Now we're looking at the ONN, which is on, or no, on off button. Uh, but this is the 50 inch TV. It's going to be $149? $148. Sorry, $148. Even cheaper. This is, I did not think it was going to be good. <laughs> Actually has a pretty solid um, picture. It's very comparable to a couple of the Samsungs you see down there. Um, it's not going to be anything amazing, but for that price range of 50 inch and a little bit of 4K, that's a steal. Now, keep in mind, it's not a smart TV, so you're going to want to have a Roku or an Amazon Fire Stick or whatever it is you choose to use. Taking a look at some of the tablets that they have at Walmart. Um, they have these on brands again like the tv they impressed us um the tablets um so the um they have a 10 inch one that's going to be 59 dollars, and they have a 7 inch one that's going to be 28 dollars. now this thing is um really underwhelming 
Uh, I can't really expect too great of quality out of such a low-end device, but I think if you have some headphones, you could do some mild web browsing, uh, video watching. It'd be great for kids, though. To a more premium one, Samsung has a 10.1 inch one for that's going to be $150 on Black Friday. Now this thing is way nicer. The screen is way nicer. The video quality is way nicer, and the end the onboard speakers are way nicer. Also has a decent camera, not the best, just kind of decent. Air executives for the $35 is definitely your best bet. Yeah, they're more premium. Uh, but the Air Sports and the Air uh, J Buds Air are both going to be a good bet too. Yeah, Sports are obviously going to be better if you want to work out and stuff. They're going to keep it in there. The yes. J Buds Air, honestly, if you're looking at those two. I would definitely spend the $5 to get the air executives. All right, so I'm just finishing editing up the video and I realized we forgot to shoot an outro that night. So I'm just uh, gonna do it real quick. If you're new to the channel, thank you so much for watching. Uh, make sure to hit subscribe so you can see future videos from us. Hopefully we did pretty good. We try to find just the best general deals that everyone could access. Um, some of them you're going to have to get there early. Some of them you have to wait in line to get these deals. Um, we try to point it out as best we could as in the deal. Um, the TVs, they're all already on sale. So we didn't do the doorbell at Best Buy we did the doorbusters at um, Walmart so the Walmart ones are not on sale but the Best Buy ones you can go grab those right now um, those prices are, um, are really really good um, really good discounts the earbuds got kind of confusing so um, each store has their own pair of J lab uh, wireless earbuds they're all right around thirty dollars except those air executives the air executives are going to be um, thirty four dollars at Walmart the air sports um, those are gonna be um, the ones that stay in your ear better for maybe like working out or doing activities. Those ones are going to be $30 at Target. And the J Bud Airs, just the regular ones you pop in your ear, um, those ones are going to be $30 at Best Buy. So no matter which store you go to, you can probably get your hands on a pair of uh, wireless earbuds. We just tried to have a lot of fun with this video, do something a little different, do a vlog style. Sorry it's a little messy, um, but that's just kind of how vlogs are. Um, maybe we'll do more of these in the future, like shopping videos or stuff like that. Um, I don't know, time will tell, but thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, feel free to comment down below. We will try to get back to you as soon as we can. We know like we didn't cover in depth with a lot of this stuff. Um, so if you have any questions at all, please do not hesitate to ask. Thanks. Peace.